Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm doing this makeup look. Um, it's quite neutral and simple on the eyes. I used used three different eyeshadows, um, so it's pretty pretty simple. Um, I've also attempted some faux freckles. So if you guys want to see or learn how I did this makeup look, then just keep watching and I'll show you. So to prime my face, I'm going to be taking my Smashbox Pore Minimizing Primer. And for foundation, I'm just using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Foundation Stick in the shade Ivory. And just buffing that in with a Zoeva 102 Silk Finish Brush. eyebrows just taking the Anastasia Beverly Hills brow powder duo in ebony brush through with a spoolie and taking my Zoeva brow line brush I'm just gonna start at the top of the brow and follow my arch around I like to just do short stroking motions like this What we'll do is, is we'll go underneath and we'll just follow that natural brow line. And buff that upwards. Take it on top. I'm going to set over them with the Chi Chi Brow Fiber in dark brown. And I'm just taking a little tiny bit of concealer on a small flat brush. And I'm just going to carve out the bottom of the brows and prime the eyelids as well. Now moving on to our eyes, um, the first colour I'm going to take is Caramel by Anastasia Beverly Hills and just run that through my crease. And now taking this shade Sienna, just layering those colours. So bringing that a little bit lower down into the crease. And buffing that out. I'm using a lighter hand with this shade also. Taking this um, Metallics eyeshadow in Pearl German. We'll go back in with our blending brush and just buff out the edges of that. Now I'm just taking that same caramel and sienna colour and I'm just going to run it under my lower lash line. Then taking a liquid liner, I'm just using this black one by Lime Crime which is called Quill. And on my inner corner, I'm just going to use that same Pearl German eyeshadow by Astralis. My mascara is the Roller Lash by Benefit and my eyelashes are Sexy AF for Socialize. Now I'm going to conceal under my eyes as per usual with the, with the MAC Pro Longwear Concealer. And then I'm just going to buff that out. And then 
going to set under my eyes and the rest of my face using the NYX HD Finishing Powder. And then for bronzer, I'm using this Bahama Mama. And then to contour, I'm just taking the fawn shade from Anastasia Beverly Hill, putting that under my cheekbones. My temples, just run it down the sides of my nose. For blush, I'm just going to take this little side here, and what is this? This is the NYX Blush and Contour Duo. And for highlight, my favourite. Then my favourite highlight in the whole entire universe ever is this Sleek Solstice palette, and I'm going to take this peachy colour down here and probably mix it with the yellow. I'm going to put it on my nose, Cupid's so chin. And then what I wanted to do is I really wanted to do like faux freckles. Should we try? Let's give it a go. And this is the Ardell Brow Defining Palette in light. Just because I've, just because I've seen that people use brow powders or like brow products to do it. This one is a little itty bitty teeny tiny brush and it's from Zoeva and it is the spot liner, the 210 spot liner. And if all else fails, I've got this lip liner from MAC in stripped down. I might just try all three and see which works better. So I'm gonna take this little tiny Zoeva brush. Oh, my hip. <laughs> so I'm just gonna mix the two shades together and just Can you see? Let's just keep going and we'll see what we what we come up with. I feel like that's heaps. I might try the um I might try the lip liner. Take my foundation brush and just like tap over them. What do you think? I don't know. I don't know. But it was fun. What do you think? Do you feel like they need to be a little bit darker? I don't want to go too dark and then look silly. Oh well. Let's do the lips. I want to go bright and like summery because we're coming into warmer weather now so i'm using the charlotte tilbury lip liner and this is in kiss and tell Fill them in with Jared Cosmetics Hydra Matte Liquid Lipstick in Mercury Rising. And this is the finished look. I'm going to zoom you in so you can have a closer look at the eyes and probably these freckles, which I'm not 100% about, but I don't know. It was fun. It was something different. I 
hope you guys enjoyed this video. I had heaps of fun filming it. The freckles. I don't know, but it was something different. Maybe I'll have to practice with different products. Maybe with like brow pencils or pomades or something like that. Or maybe even like liquid lipsticks. I don't know. I mean, it's it's fine. I don't think it looks too fake, but it doesn't exactly look real. Isn't that so funny? We like put all this foundation on all of these products on to like cover up our natural freckles and then we go ahead and put fake ones on. I don't know. I mean, I think it's a pretty cool trend that's going around at the moment and I wanted to give it a go, so I did. So give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and don't forget to subscribe if you aren't already. I'll have all of the products that I've used listed down below and links to all of my other social media platforms. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you have an amazing day wherever you are in the world and I'll see you next time.